What's going on YouTube, it's your boy Dark Mode and today I'm going to be playing a very cute, lovely PG game. Now this is a game that is different from the other games that I've played, whereas the other games, they were kind of very bloody. You know, there was a lot of killing, a lot of violence, a lot of weapons. You know, but this game seems more cute and more softer with butterflies and cute little animals. You know, little Pokemon animals. So, it's a bit different from the genre of games that I've been playing recently. So, that being said, the game that I'm going to be playing is called Kina Bridge of Spirits. Now, like always, I'm going to jump into what it's about. It's a short read. Um, this is going for me as well as those that are not aware of this game. This game was released, I believe, September last year. So it's, it's been out for just over a year now. And it's a game that I have purchased, which I purchased, um, I would say about four months ago. It's been sitting in my drawer. So um, it's a game that, that is on my bucket list and I must finish it because I've been sitting on it for now four months so that being said let me just get into this and read what it's all about for those of you who are seeing this for the first time so basically it's called Kina the bridge of spirits um, it's about a young spirit guide who makes her way to an abandoned village in search of a sacred mountain shrine the village is located within a massive overgrown forest plagued by a curse and filled with restless spirits. Kina's main goal is to uncover the secrets behind the village's forgotten community and help its spirits move on to the afterlife. She will have to engage in battle with the more corrupted spirits and use the aid of the rot which are the small black creatures capable of decomposing nature's dead and rotting elements so it's a pretty straightforward story you know it's like the game that i played before i think about a month ago called the medium where she helps unsettled spirits to cross over and find peace in the next life well this is the same thing but just a more pg version you know so this is what Kina has to do. She just has to help those unsettled spirits find peace so that they can cross over. How simple is that? And that being said, let's just jump straight into it because I don't want to hold you guys up and I don't want to hold myself back because I'm looking forward to playing this game. Um, but before we do, one more thing, like always, don't forget to um, subscribe, like and leave a comment and um you know especially like and leave a comment because you know as i said before in previous games that you know the algorithm pleasing the youtube algorithms is not an easy task so you showing support for this channel for the smaller creators that are trying to get a voice out on the youtube platform it would help a lot it's such a small action but for channels such as mine it really helps so if you can um, before you watch this video smash that like button that being said politics out of the way let's just jump straight into this guys see you there what's going on guys welcome you back um yeah so i'm just at the PlayStation home screen. What's all this? Just checking this stuff out. But anyway, I know you're not you're not here for that. You're here for the Kina Bridge of Spirits gameplay. So let's just kick into this. Okay. New game. Okay, so you know, guys, before we get in, into all this, you know, don't forget to like, subscribe, um, leave a comment on whatever game that you want me to play or try out. And 
if you're new around here consider subscribing if you're interested in video gaming and seeing the latest games being played and no doubt I will give my honest review and also I'll be hitting them old school classic games as well from time to time we can't forget about them um, them old retro games not too retro but you know maybe a few years back 2015 13 11 2011 those time periods so you know subscribe you know support the channel but anyway that being said all that politics out of the way let's just get into it so we're going to before we get into the game i want to check out the options story mode apprentice spirit guide yeah so we're gonna hit um i'm not ready for you know obviously expert but we're gonna go for spirit guide that's what we're gonna go somewhere medium okay uh, we're going to show that um, button legends I don't know what that is let's just look into controls we keep as is graphics again performance mode let's see what's on the other one nah we're doing the 60 frames per second 4k all the way baby um audio subtitles on night mode reduce the range between the quietest and the... we keep this off keep it default uh accessibility subtitle size I'd have liked to see I don't know, I should have checked to see what number it was on before but anyway we keep it like that can't see the opacity I'd have liked a sample but not to worry get back to that okay so let's this so I did spirit guide okay okay why does it keep on spirit guide okay um get out of this new game oh this is where you do all of the um okay let's see what they're saying my ability to reach out to us and take uh, apprentice spirit guide spirit guide expert um Spirit guide. Adjust the slide until the symbol is barely okay. I'll say somewhere like that for me. Guys, I'm super excited. Unique wooden masks are carved to honor the dead placed in sh sacred shrines. These masks gradually return to dust, symbolizing the spirit's peaceful journey into the next life. Not all spirits can travel th this path alone, struggling with tragedies of their past. They linger and become dangerous. Masters call upon to help these trapped and oh, no, violent. So I know my, my reading sucks. Look at that. This literally looks like a pixel film. 
look at that Jasora Mosque. Stunning. That's crazy. Oh, okay. We're in it. L1. Oh. Okay, yeah, yeah. I've seen these bits on reviews when she does this thing. Okay. Okay. Oh, she looks colourful. Looks so vibrant. Oh, so she jumped from there, I see. Let me see if it's got a double. Oh, yeah, double jump. We have a double jump. Okay, we have a light attack combo, R1, the heavy one is R2, let me see if I hold on to it, because it's small. okay, that's good, what about her run, can she crouch down, push down the sticks, hold the button, oh backflip, cool, okay, cool, let me push one. Okay, okay, we've got a um, Tomb Raider kind of feel now. This is Lara Croft, Lara Croft, Croft, whatever the name is. <laughs> yeah, okay, what about running? Sorry guys, I just wanna I know they mostly train you along the way, I'll just being too eager. Okay, okay, I got it, I got it. You push down the left thumb stick, okay. Is it indefinite? Or does she run out of steam? Let me see. Okay. I think the chick can run on forever. I like that little pixie jump she does. She reminds me of a fairy like Tinkerbell. In fact, this world so far that I've seen in little clips looks like a place where Tinkerbell will be. Okay. Can she walk? Oh yeah, there she goes. Okay. Let's get more kids as well. Spirits. But guys, if any of you have watched any of my old, well, my old gameplays, you would you would know that I like to kind of explore. I know for some that could be frustrating. Can she swim past now? Can she die? Okay, we have a door here. Okay, let's just go to this ghostly filler. Okay, step on it. There we go. Beautiful. The character design of her is so nice. Yes. It's running a bit. Whoa, okay, okay, that's good. What do we have here? Why have you come? I sense suffering here, spirit. Do you need help? <laughs> she looks sweet. Nothing. Oh, suffering. This is my home. My village. Turn back. Spirit to go. 
destroyed. My attacks. Okay. We got it. Let's see if we can combo it. Dodge. Yep. Okay. Seems I beat you guys. Whoa. Take that. Okay. It feels quite. It's mobile. She doesn't feel stiff, she feels quite nimble. Okay, there's a door. Like always guys, you know we do. We like to explore. Oh, one side stun. Okay. Stun the hover. Go back in the center. Oh, okay. Don't have to. This cave's so big. Go. Okay, so you do have to go in the center. There we go. Yeah, so far so good. Movements are nice and light. You know, just can't wait to get outside and see those soft. Oh, wow. There is a light at the end of the tunnel. Makes me feel like I'm going, going somewhere quite beautiful. We're going to walk it up there, guys. I can't rush down. Look at the. Wow. Does she have a zoom? You can see the floor or something. Wow. Look at the graphics, the visuals, it's stunning. The cool breeze is blowing the grass on the left just about. But let's easily just walk up there. The sun just hitting uh, the side of the head. Beautiful. Hey, I feel like I've crossed over myself to the next world. Look at that. It's getting intense, background music. There we go. She seems alert. She's it looks like she's getting ready to fight someone. Okay. It's beautiful. The sun rays dropping in. Let me see. Let me look back down. Oh, okay. Just the hour with the kitchen. I like how soft the trees look. Say this must have took a long time. Like, look at that, guys. I'm into all this greenery kind of stuff. I feel that it heals the soul being in nature like this. Uh, oh, okay. Let's get back into it. Um, 
Yeah, I saw. Can't see nothing. Find anything around here. Just the amount of right leaves this flowing down. Beautiful. The only thing that's missing is this rain. I'm a big lover of rain. I don't want to rush it. I really just want to just stroll. everywhere I don't know if that signifies good luck or if that's a fox I'm gonna start looking at me is that an owl okay. let's see if I can disturb like the oh it does move it a bit I talk about that on stray that you go through the bushes or the un overgrowth or undergrowth whatever you want to call it it doesn't look the tree or the bushes it doesn't disturb it but this one it does somewhat yeah the more real the more better that's what I always think It. That's cool. She suits this environment though, I must say. These little particles. Whatever they are. It's magical. Disappeared. These spirits. Okay, now let's go over here. Oh, that sucks. The reason why I say this sucks because I would have. They could have easily did it, you know. I think at this point they must have been a bit lazy, but um. It would have been nice if the waterfall had like, you know, it hits her shoulder and her hair and it kind of parts a bit as she goes through. It just seems like she's just, is she even wet? I don't think she's even wet. Let me see. Oh, she's not wet. She's not normal. Yeah. That didn't affect her at all. It would have been nice if her hair got wet um, my clothes were a bit damp or some kind of just wet you know and the water had parted a bit because obviously a human <laughs> is standing in its pathway but anyway I know you guys are mostly thinking oh, about you being fussy now but I'm just saying it could have easily been done if they've gone to this this great works to um all this effort to create these visuals that was this that would have been a small thing 
Let me see the water walking in the water. Does it even ripple? Nah, it doesn't even. It just gives you little splashes here and there when you stop. I think the splashes are too um, animated in comparison to that of the water because the water looks kind of still and clear. You know, I am a game critic, guys. This is what I do. Well, then you do something better than that. I can't. But they make games so that people can play it and also give constructive um, criticism. And that's what I'm doing, guys. Okay, let's just get moving. Oh yeah, I've meant to get that little um, tubby thing. Is it over here? Oh, what's that? Collect. Oh, collect. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Find the rot. Search for more rot in the area. Okay, let's just do this. Yeah, double jump, okay. Hey, <laughs> hey, come back. It's not a game of hide and seek, you little brats. Oh, I found another one. I thought that was a puddle. Huh. Oh, I've got five and five. see some oh okay okay collect that's what we want Kids, hey, come back. Hey. Other things helping me, it's telling me where it is. Okay. the rot. Oh, the hearts go up. Okay. What other functions? Make it dance. Or you dance. Okay, this is stand up. 
colors are so vibrant. It's just right. One more. Yeah, it would have been nice. I know that it's irking me that the fact that you walk through and you can't even tell she's walking through. Look at that on the floor. At least this is done right. It sucks, bro. Next gen, man. What's going on? Okay, the rock can now perform, the rock can help. Your team of companions have grown and you now have one rock action available. Press square to send the rock onto objects in the environment. Collect rock to level up and gain more rock actions. Okay, me and most of me they do other things. Oh, this one's deeper. That sounds like someone was doing a dump. Oh, now she's wet. Okay, I like that. Let's just... Yeah, she's wet. No freaky. So what do we have over here? Use the rock. <coughs> Press L1 to pulse and destroy the dead zone. Okay. Okay. Okay, so this is what you're gonna have to do to certain areas, dead zones. That's what they call them. I like ah oh, the green. Oh, that's nice. Beautiful place. Yeah. And there is literally no houses or no nothing, but it just look at that. Sometimes I think this is just how the world's meant to be, man. You know, when we create buildings embedded in nature, not knocking down nature. And I reckon the earth will be such a nicer place. Just imagine. Like, oh, okay. Can I just come? Just imagine that. Like, you've got mansions and. 
two trees knocked down but you've got nice mansions and pathways and this is all these green chip um, trees the only concern would be I guess is if there was a fire oh that's cool kick the head for new toys Oh, okay. You jump, I didn't know. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I'm so mesmerized. Oh, okay. With the white ledges, paint, whatever you want to call that, that's a sign that you can jump up. Oh, another dead zone. Enemies frighten the rock. The rock are scared and have gone into hiding. Attack enemies to build courage in combat. Spend courage to perform rock actions. Spend courage. What that means. Okay, courage drops. Courage drops and perform in the world. Okay, let courage drop with the pulse Destroy dead zones hearts or bind enemies. Press square to quickly send your rock onto objects in the environment. Hold hold L2 to aim and then press square to bind enemies. That, okay, I tax them. Dead zone gone. This is the second. This is the second place. Dead zone I've destroyed now. Alright. Beautiful. The rock can move certain objects in the environment. Press square to have the rock pick up an object. Tell the rock where to go by aiming the what's that? L2 and then pressing square. Okay. Release it from now and we'll see what's around here. Is 
is wrong. Okay, I wonder what benefits I get from that. I've got pictures of rocks. Okay, you got picked up. Okay, I understand now. Okay, white ledge. See it? Drop it there. I see the play. I see the. Oh, oh. Okay, <clears throat> let's do this. Square, pick it up. He said L2. Okay, okay. Move object. Wait, where? Let me make sure it's in the same place. Okay, if it's red, that means you can't. Okay. Square. Beautiful game. I keep on saying it, but I'm... Look at, look at the lights just coming through. Release. Release. Through that ninja. Naruto. We're now under the Genjutsu. Alright. So things that glisten, diamonds, 25 diamonds, that's, things that glisten, they're the things that should get your attention. Anyway, let's just go up here, jump, okay, run, jump, easy, she does that all gracefully. Let's see what's down there, can I hide in there? Can you move that for me? Okay, 50 diamonds. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Okay, here's the one. a man let me help you I can heal these spirits and restore balance to the forest I know you are kind which is you sense the power that flows through this land but you do not fully understand it He firmed that. I called him spirit, not even like he used to be a human. Whoa, what is this I'm looking at? 
Okay. Okay, this is not good. I think she's gonna die, bro. Ain't there no help? No! Whoa! Oh, she's good. she's got one more here. Whoa! Okay. Oh, please don't let. I hope there's a skip option. There has to be. Let me help you. I can heal these spirits and restore balance to the forest. Come on, punk. Whoa! He's me. Wow! He's hot! Let me help you. I think my shield has a health. Oh my days. Gotta do something. Whoa. Calm down. It's not that serious. One more hit, guy. Whoa. Are oh, you sprout, man? Wow, go on. Again. Let's do this. Yeah. Let me help you. Come and do that again. Oh, okay. Whoa. Wow. I think my shield's maxed out. Ah, oh, two. Yes. 
got you, buddy. Okay. I'll get this. Okay, that was quite difficult for a first boss. You can come out. It's safe now. Look, Saya, she cleared away the poison. The little guys can eat it. Yeah, that's what they do. They love it. They love it. <laughs> My name's Kana. What are you two doing out here, alone in the forest? Don't worry about us. We've been here a long time and take care of ourselves. Huh? I can see that. You both look very strong. Do you know who that spirit was with the horned mask? We don't know, but when he shows up, the gross poison grows stronger. Hey, what are you doing here in the forest? I'm searching for the sacred mountain shrine. Can you take me there? Sacred. If you want to get to the mountain shrine, you have to help us with something first. <laughs> Business Our brother Tar was trapped deep in the forest. We need you to help him. Great idea, Saya. That'll be easy for her. Did you see what she did to that stick guy? Help us free Tar and we'll take you to the mountain shrine. That, that sounds like a deal. Woohoo! Come on, our village is this way. Yeah, I found that boss quite difficult. Not difficult, but maybe like a bit tricky. Anyway, we're gonna walk up here. We're gonna build up some suspense, guys. It's just pure white, what I see. Overexposed sky. I don't want to rush this, okay, wow, we're getting there, oh that's beautiful, for that Kung Fu Panda. Beautiful, there are people that live in places like this, got a Switzerland, okay, it's the prologue. We've got Switzerland that has very stunning backgrounds. One day I shall go there. That's on my bucket list. That and Japan. Okay, map available press. Okay. That's the map. Okay, it's not quite big. Unless these darker bits are to be revealing themselves later on in the game. Of that. Ouch. That is beautiful. I'm not seeing houses down there. Rooftops. Just imagine living in a place like this. Incredible. Beautiful. Guys, I'm a sucker for, you know, panoramic views and stuff like this with nature. I love nature, I love greenery. It's peaceful. It gives something that the city can't give. I feel like I would heal in a place like this. Beautiful. Okay. 
I did this did this simple little pathway. That's oh, beautiful man. I'm actually smiling and playing this game. I'm really at all here. Yeah. Okay. The village. Oh, wow, okay, 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 okay. Examine. The spring that runs beneath the forge carries with it energy from the mountain shrine. Okay. Maybe later on we'll get. Reminds me of Devil May Cry when there's some spirit barriers there blocking pathways. And then it goes away once you do the task. Okay, we have another dead zone. 